I didn't know much about Parkinson's. Occasionally you see someone in a restaurant and their hands are shaking and you know unmistakably that that's not a flu. There's also no cure and it just hits you like a brick. You get an instant realization that no matter what happens from this point forward is that you don't get to feel better. I've always been a picture of health. I don't drink, I don't smoke. Well, I drink like all Russians a little bit, uh, but not like the real Russians. I didn't do anything to deserve this, I guess. I don't necessarily look all that sick. Women fake orgasms, I can fake worse Parkinson's. And I buy Parkinson's for dummies. This is the definitive guide. It will tell me everything I want to know. And on every page, bold letters, there is no cure. By page 10, you don't want to read this book anymore. If I were to write a book on Parkinson's, I would start, there is no cure, but here's what you can do to help yourselves. So to this day, I haven't figured out a way to get a support group. I mean, what are we gonna do? Get together, hold hands that are shaking and, and shake in rhythm? I mean, that's, that's a dance class. That's what I do for a living. Parkinson's is actually not that bad compared to what older people are going through. Heart problems, prostate problems, intestinal problems, oh god, and then Viagra doesn't work sometimes. That's worse than Parkinson's, it has to be. You just type in Parkinson's cures and you've got window after window after window of every conceivable remedy from yak's urine to suppositories and I know just the idea of it makes you shake a little a little more. I read recently that you have to take coconut oil. I didn't know whether to eat it, to lick it or sit on it. So I still haven't tried it. You have to try everything. You know when the doctors tell you there's nothing they can do, you have to pretty much run around the block. Speaking of running, this is what works the best. See, these people have it all figured out, all these runners here. I used to look at these people and think, they're freaking crazy. Who would want to run? Ha, huh. I do. Hi, see this woman? She's got to be 100. She looks 50. That's jogging for you. Be careful of the internet cures. Some of them don't work, especially the suppositories for Parkinson's. Maybe if I was living in the village. The real fear that you live with 24 hours a day is that there is no cure, and there will be no cure in the foreseeable future. I try to do everything I can to stay as healthy as possible, and that has been the salvation. I figured out a way to keep Parkinson's as far away from me as possible. I should go on a lecture circuit and tell all the people, poor people that are suffering from Parkinson's, you know, what it is that you have to do. And you know what? 
The formula is pretty simple. Exercise, diet, and try to be stress-free.